I'm not a lesbian, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of people think I'm a lesbian because I'm not very girly and that. That's why I wear the bow, yeah? <laughs> I, uh, I'm in Brighton, you know what I mean? Fuck it, I, um... No, but it's shit, it's genuinely, it's so shit for me, because like, I genuinely, I, I get, like, homophobic comments with none of the perks. <laughs> Which basically means I get ostracised without having any of the pleasure of getting my fanny lit properly. <laughs> <laughs> it's shit out here, man. <laughs> I wasn't in a relationship with the geezer, I was, I wasn't in a relationship with a man for, for seven years and uh, we're not together anymore and uh, what I've realised since, since being in different relationships and being single and that sort of stuff is uh, I never ever want to get married, like ever, ever, it's just not for me innit, like, I just don't, yeah I just, I just don't want to get married innit, like ever, ever, <laughs> I mean obviously I still want someone to propose to me, uh, <laughs> like my dream is someone say to me, Sarah we've been together for five years now and I've never felt this way about anyone, will you marry me and I'll just be like, Nah. <laughs> no, no. Uh, <laughs> but don't get me wrong, when I, when I am in a relationship, I'm very loving, I am. I'm very loving, very romantic. I like to leave like kooky post notes around the house. Like ones on the bathroom mirror that say, I love you. Yeah, and then like ones on, on, on the fridge that say, you make me so happy. Yeah, and then like one on the door on the way out, if you leave me, I will cut you. <laughs> Me and my ex we used to argue a lot, we used to argue so much, we had such a volatile relationship, it was horrible, like, and, and uh, I'm sure this happened to some of you lot, like, we always used to argue on, spe uh, argue on special occasions, so like, we'd plan something, we'd go out, and then we'd argue and just ruin it, it was horrible, it was so, so horrible, right? Mm -hmm. You know, like, like, getting dumped on your birthday, harsh, innit? You know, or like, or like getting dumped at Easter. I'd be like, yeah, alright then, mate, you walk away, you'll be back, give it three days. <laughs> <laughs> Getting dumped on Valentine's Day? Fucking hell, it takes a special type of bastard to dump someone on Valentine's Day, innit? You get the card, you open it, it just says, you're getting dumped, but by who, question mark? <laughs> getting dumped on Pancake Day? Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> getting dumped on Pancake Day? <sighs> You'd flip. <laughs> Wait, I'm glad you love that, because that was a shit joke, innit? <laughs> that was just for me. Wait, a mate of mine, yeah, he got so pissed off at his bird, he actually dumped her on the countdown to New Year's. Can you imagine it? Ten, nine, eight, Jane, you dumped. What? You heard? Three, two, one. Oh, yeah. Good shit. I, uh...